Hello everybody, this is Sonia now. I'm back here again because I wanted to show you a few things that I've been making. Yesterday, I had a really good time. Was it yesterday or the day before? Must have been Sunday, yeah. I suppose I finished it yesterday. I started making this. <laughs> Isn't this, oh well, I think it's really cool. <laughs> it has a bit of a wobble up. But this is a Christmas tree. You see that? Mm -hmm. It's a Christmas tree. And it was ever so much fun. And he had a boot on. The only thing I need to do with the next one I make is make his legs longer so that you can see the boots better. Um, I really had fun making that. I thought that was really cool. I just madly, only thing wrong, can't sell it or anything because it's got, or gifted away because it's got bits of yellow for me glue gun which I have got switched on here at the moment which I need to turn off because it's not good hang on a second everybody let's pull that out and make sure that I've got the right one I'll unplug that good that's good I've unplugged it um and I didn't do the next ones that I covered I didn't do with the glue gun because look at that it dried yellow yellow yucky and plus I haven't done up under his, his or her skirt yet you see I put it on this board because the little feet were too small to hold such a large bit um, I told <laughs> I was making something awesome but I thought it was anyway so I hope he's like that um, because now I'm going to show you how to make it but I'll show you the other, well, other thing I did as well first I made this little snowman. I watched the lady make this. Now, there goes my air conditioner. Oh dear, I hope that that doesn't be too loud. I'm terribly sorry. It might turn off again in a minute when it's ready. It's making a purring sound, hey? <clears throat> but anyway, it best me to have that on than be sick from the, from the heat. But anyway, so I made this out of a shock, of course. Um, I went and I bought myself some kids' socks because I didn't really want a big snowman and these I, I don't think they were good good quality or anything and I thought well they're only they only cost me a few dollars for a fair few here I've got about six pair I think and um, I thought I thought well I'll I'll have a go at this now there's a girl there's lots of people out there make these so it'll be easy for you to go and find something some, a tutorial on how to make them because isn't it cute and it took me about oh, four, four, 10 minutes, 10 or 15 minutes at the most because I only just had to look for a few things. It's all glued, no sewing, no sewing whatsoever. There's the heel of the, oh no, there's the toe. <laughs> and he's got his hat on. I might have to fasten that on a bit better, two little eyes, and that was my snowman. And a bit of ribbon, I thought that looked okay for his, for his um, round him there. So that's my snowman. Um, now, I'm going to show you how I made this. I imagine everybody knows how to make this sort of thing because all you have to do is have a cone like this to start with. Now you can make your own cone. The only trouble is, the only thing wrong with that is you have to have a base on it because you need to fasten the feet to it, okay? And that's, the, that's why I'm going to show you how. I've been wrapping these ones here as well because I you know just got so carried away because I found some little ones too um, so I just wanted to show you like I'll, I'll show you through how, how to do it now you'll need something like this you can I suppose you can use no I'm saying you're gonna have to have this because you have to push the legs up into that and because this is something that will come apart here look I'll give you I'll give you an idea now what am I saying let me see I think I've left that stick thing and I poked this hole in yesterday out there you need to well let's start from the beginning okay so we need to see if you can find some real pipe cleaners right when I say real ones the chenille sticks are not the right sort of they haven't got the strength they bend a bit uh, well some of them do it just depends right but I found that these are better and these are actual pipe cleaners you know you might have to probably buy them 
Could be absolute pipe cleaners, you know. But anyway, that's, that's what you're going to need. And one of these, of course, some wool or some sort of nice sort of, yeah, it's nice to have a piece. I've got plain and I've got bubbly wool and, you know, I think it looks really good. And, of course, you'll need some glue and some decorations for the colour of the thing that you want to do. Now, I'm just going to show you how to do a bit of this one, then I'll go to that one and we'll proceed it as we go along because I want to be able to fit this all on. And, of course, don't forget, we will need some shoes. Now, I'm lucky enough to already have that. You can go and pinch them off the kids' dolls. <laughs> I didn't do that. I have these shoes here, and I wish that I had kept the rest of them because I had a whole heap. I sold them to a lady a long time ago, a lot of them, that were the size that I would have needed. These are small, and that's okay, because I think they'll work. By the time I put some stuff in, around them, these are fairly big. Now, because they're dark colour, they're going to be really hard to disguise. And I just don't know if I need to put them on there. If I just had something between the two sizes, it would be absolutely awesome. Well, to be honest with you, I've got one. And, he's only, and I've got one. So I'm going to go and search and see if I can find another one. Because I think that would be a good size. So I might put these on the green tree when I get to that. Okay. So as now for this one, I'm going to put some white. I've got this wool. Now it's fluffy and I hate the feel of it I really hate the feel of it it's not very nice but it makes you it's still so creepy <laughs> I don't know how to explain that creepy feeling wool in mind okay so we need some glue now I sat out there and watched telly yesterday and I just sat there oh, well, for last night I was sitting there with hubby and I just did this now it takes a little while okay we're starting at the top Sonia and it takes like I said it takes a little while but it's worth the effort it really is because I think they come out really well. I know it's a tree and everybody's seen, but it's got shoes on for goodness sake, you know. So we're going to start out by coating this. And I'm not going to burn my fingers because I don't have the glue gun. So this is like a Chanel sort of look, isn't it, to it? But I wanted to make this sort of one because I won't be able to do anything with that other one. Will I give it to anybody that's like that? Now, <clears throat> you need to actually do this a fair bit as you're going like when I say do this you need to put glue on a fair bit you can't just put it here and there because it will slip up, it'll slip apart okay so try and do as much glue as you can and just go around and make sure that it's all joined up together okay so that's what we're going to do with that we're going to take that all the way down there now if you want to you can do this now as well you can put the pipe cleaner because you need one for the top so you push that down in there because that's where you can pretend whatever this is okay now i've actually covered this in cream wool which i just didn't realize till now because i was in the dark not actually in the dark but i've covered that with cream color wool look at this oh my goodness me see it's definitely wrong <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, he's, he turned out wrong. Plus, this um, round here's the wrong colour. But you got to do something to get started. You know, you got to you got to start off somewhere, don't you? So you press that, push this pot cleaner down into there to where you got it to the length that you want it to be. But you can also cut it off if you if you like. Okay, and then I will come back later and I will wrap that with this so it's a continuation of that. And then I'm going to hang something on him which i can do that and show you that too after but that's how we'll do all that okay we'll wrap all that first then we need to get i'm going to put a piece of felt i think on the bottom of this because i'm going to go now to this one because it needs something or should i use paper you know what should i put because i have to have little holes to put the feet but i can make them in the felt can't i yes i can do that so i'm going to glue this on here first because as you might have seen if you do watch me at all you'd know that I like to stick stuff on before I cut it out a lot of people do like to do that just to make sure it fits otherwise than cutting out something four times or something and it doesn't even fit, fit any time okay so we're going to put this on here like so okay because you want to have them complete like the one I'm doing like I did it's not not complete because I didn't um I couldn't do that because he wasn't made properly. He has a little, he has flaws in him, so I don't want him to. He can be my one, can't he? He'll be the one that I keep and over there. Right now, as I said in my other video, hubby's in there painting. 
and I have to eat. And I said to him, what do you want me to do? <laughs> and he more or less, he doesn't say, but he says, oh, I don't, he doesn't need any help, so he's good. He fell over once and then they already too. Never mind. I imagine he's up to painting already, you know, because he's washed the walls and he's going to do painting. I don't know if he, I suppose he starts at the ceiling, doesn't he? He's probably painting the ceiling now as we speak. Okay, so that's the bottom, all right? Now, I'm going to have to go and poke a hole through where I think these two pieces are going to have to go. So, um, I want to line them up. Maybe I'll just take them across there's one. I'm going to do the hole so I can see where it is. Well, I can't really see that. I hope you can see what I'm doing. And we want to put that one there. I'm eyeballing this, as you can see, and that's not really, really the centre. And it just went through that bit. Now, did I twist them round or not? Let me see. To make these little legs... <coughs> I think I might have twisted it. Um, like this. And made a foot. Now, that's not going to be good because that's not going to be long enough. Or is it? See, I want to be able to see these shoes on this one. I can it on the other one, but this is this is the one that I want it, you know. I want to be able to see the shoes. Should be able to. Should be. Let's just roll this and get some glue on it. Because we might have to make this hole a bit better. We'll, we'll do that with the end of this, this um, pipe cleaner. Okay. Right now, we're going to have to make that hole a bit better than that. But of course, as usual, so I've left things out in the other place, in the other part of the house, which you would have thought I'd have brought with me today because I planned on doing this. Something sharp. I need something sharp that I'm not going to injure myself with. Oh, dear me, come on. There's a pair of scissors here. Oh, hang on. Think. Put an orange packet. Here we go. Look at this. <laughs> I got sent these by that by a lovely girl. She sent me that last parcel. Here we go. Look at that. Let's make a hole. Push that in there. Make another hole. Now I'm going to put that in and just test it to see. And then get the other one. I'm going to glue it up there. Nobody panic that in half. These are six inches. I know, which is 50, 50 millimetre, no? 50 centimetres? No, there's 50 in there. <laughs> I'll get this in a minute. Now push that up there. Alright. I hope we're still going to be able to see them. I think we will when he gets his shoes on. And then, thank goodness, that turned off. Okay, there we go. Now put that in there like that. I don't know if I'll use, keep the laces. Right, so that's going to be enough to push if I push it up that far. Okay, so now I'm going to have to put some glue in there somehow. Right, I'm going to have to wipe the end of that. Put the glue maybe on here. Maybe I'll put some glue on here and a bit of it might hang on to where well, I'm pushing it in, okay, that might be a bit mighting under that. There we go. Just push him up there like that. I think I forgot to twist this one. That wasn't very smart, was it, Sonia? No, leave it. Leave it alone. I oh, know the other one's got the shoes on the wrong feet. <laughs> I'll show you that in a minute. Ah, oh, dear. <laughs> Definitely, definitely wasn't meant to make that other one, was I? <laughs> oh, well, you know, it just, it's trouble in the area. You've got to have a go. And I just had to make some, no matter what. Because I just thought they were good. I've seen these on Pinterest, I think. It could have been, yes, it was, because I was looking for a tree of some sort. I don't know, and I seen it there. Come here, you. Flicking away. Now, I've got shoelaces. Okay. Now if I put those on there, 
body. Can you see that? There's his leg. How much is this one's leg is hanging out the bottom? Oh, we'll see. I don't think he's as, maybe he's the same length. Might be a tiny bit longer, which is really good because you need to put a skirt on. And that's what's covering up a lot of it, eh? Okay. Now, um, I'm going to, well, I can put the thing on the top of this, but I'm going to roll those now and I need to find the green wool. He's going to have to have green legs, isn't he? And I don't really need, I don't think that you're going to need to know a lot more about how I did it. Um, because, you know, it's pretty, pretty basic. Um, if anybody really needs a lot more detail on, on how it was, these were done, you can just send me a message and tell me, ask me if I'll please do one from the beginning or something, I don't know. But I think it's it's pretty pretty basic. I'm, maybe I would have rolled these first up. I don't know whether I did that with the other one. I don't think I did. Oh, I think these legs are going to look awesome green. Don't you? Because it's more, it shows up a lot better than than the other, than the white ones. But because you want to finish off things good. And we'll see with this ordinary glue, ordinary clark, craft glue, well, was good good stuff actually um, you can I know, it's a bit wonky you can uh, get a better go like you, it's still it's still not dry so therefore you can just keep rolling what you need to do is what I've actually done pull that a little bit too tight there so he's got a little bit of a buckle in his leg you know he's a bit wonky but um, I think he'd be okay I'll go back and fix it if I get too upset with it, if it's not right. Okay, now I'll do this foot because I can show you then, I'll do one and show you how to put it on the shoe. Put, and I put, actually I wrapped a bit more because, you know, he needs a good size foot to fit, fill his shoe up, doesn't he? But he wants to, he wants to be able to stand up nicely. Now, I'm not saying this is how this is supposed to go because uh, this is just how I did it. Okay, this is what I made, how I made mine. All right, now, <clears throat> more, more shoe fitting on. Make sure I put it on the right feet this time. I don't know whether that they have a right and left foot, these things, but this is quite annoying trying to get this on here. It doesn't feel like it wants to work for me, does it? Come on, open up there. I, need to, I want the top bit to stay on there so they make it a little bit high like a little boot well, otherwise I'd cut that off if it keeps it kept annoying me any other way come on get in there you get your foot in there I'm, I'm not ter terrible at dressing a tree aren't I how's that going <laughs> it's really cool <laughs> oh dear I love it I think it's gorgeous <laughs> I do now actually see that looks like it's going the wrong way that shoe but I'm not going to worry about that because I just can't deal with that today. <laughs> I just don't want to deal with that. But then I'm going to wrap the other leg and then I'm going to decorate it. And I'm going to put on, I don't know what yet, but wouldn't this be cool? Put a bit of this frilly fringe around him, her, him, hit the tree. Let me see what that's going to look like. And I can keep it in there. <laughs> Okay, well see, you know the thing of decorating takes a little while, but I think that looks a bit dowdy, I think I would have put that on there. Oops, I hope that's just a ladder, I hope he's okay. Um, <laughs> never mind, he pushed the wardrobe into the spare room or the cupboard with our clothes in it and had to go in there, had to jump over top of the cupboard to get in there to get himself something after he had his shower. So. He wasn't very happy, but he's, suddenly, he's calmed down and he's on a roll, I think. And I think this is going to look awesome, and I will bring him back and I'll show you, and I'll also show you what I get done with the rest of these, okay? Because this is going to be what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. Um, I think I'll, I don't think I'll make another snowman for a while, but I think they'll look nice sitting on the, on the kitchen table in Santa Claus time. Well, um... I'm not saying, you know, I wouldn't go out and buy things, but we can make them, can't we? I mean, you know, everything you, you can go and buy, you can make. You can make it how you want to. And yesterday I was somewhere, 
and I seen all these trees and they were just rolled around with just wire and I'm thinking well look at that and they got their and they paid a bit of money I suppose for them and but you can go and make your own and it is more a bit personal doesn't it and, and nicer I've got that little angel thing that I'm going to put on our tree this year and I'm going to decorate things about I think with this sort of stuff so thank you everybody for watching and um, I hope you do a tree and if you still, just let me know and I'll go and have a look. <laughs> okay, thank you. Bye-bye.